JBN will keep you informed. Sasha Gay Thompson speaks out as to how she felt when she was kicked out of the store by the Chinese businessman and how she is treated daily by even us Jamaicans. Please remember to like, subscribe, share, leave us a comment and click the notification bell to receive our daily news items. Okay, I am the kind of person who I don't easily take things personal. I I try to understand persons to the best of my ability. Like as in I'm educated. So I try to even if someone says something to me, I try to overlook it and just move on. But the other day when I went into the Chinese store and the Chinese man um, he said to me that why you come to my place at first it's like I didn't react to it and then he said don't come to my place with a big old wheelchair come out come out come out I turned to him and I like and I was like what do you mean what do you mean for come out come out come out come out I'm gonna I'm come out I felt bad, but then I continued my journey because I wanted to buy something so I went somewhere else. I felt bad while I was heading to another place. I felt bad that I couldn't even talk. I started to cry and I was like, I don't know what to do anymore. It's like, Like, and I said, I just don't know what to do. I I just feel lost of words. I I just felt like I was gonna give up. And I went by my mother and she asked me what's wrong and I just couldn't talk. I just couldn't talk. And then after I was there and she asked me again, what to you? With that mommy sometime. I wonder if people know that me have feelings and the things when them said to me and how them talk to me. I wonder if they know that me have feelings and me have the same feelings just like when them have. I start crying. And my mother said, tell me what happened. I said, mommy, I'm going to the store and the Chinese man behave like me, the human, and he just uh, run me out of place so I can't walk. And I say, he just, just, just imagine. Me try to overlook other persons. Me, enough persons said things to me like, me I go on, I'm there, and them like, nobody comments so with that, you know, nobody comments so with that. Sometimes I just smile and I just move on. Me even, even me have times when I go in a taxi and the driver them and behave a way. Sometimes the driver no one, no one bring me because she me in a wheelchair. And even, but honestly, we just want everyone to know say. Um, just treat me equal because I've been through a lot. I've been through a lot. I remember days when I just met in my accident. I I didn't talk. I just did that. I just did that in my world. I was depressed and I don't want to go back to that stage there. So I just, me just want them to know say, just treat me equal. Just understand that I have feelings and me a human just like them. So, just treat me equal, that's all may I ask. We ought to be more considerate of the persons in the disabled community. It is very important to see ourselves through their eyes. They still bleed red. They still have feelings. They still know to cry. They still hurt. They are already disadvantaged by a disability. They need our love and care. 
not our scorn. JBN, we keep you informed. Please remember to like, subscribe, share, leave us a comment and click the notification bell to receive our daily news items.